So if someone tries to get back with you after breaking up with you, I would be bold and be confident and say to them, listen, as much as I might like the idea of being back with you, I don't want to be back with someone who doesn't want me. I don't want to be back with someone who's not sure about me. The sexiest thing in the world is someone who's sure about you. Remember that. Too many people, and there are so many people out there right now who are chasing someone they shouldn't be, who are chasing someone who's not showing them that they deserve them. It was a big house, and we had servants. Everyone did. We knew their wives, their children. One boy, Manoj, became my friend. We played a lot of cricket together, played anything we could. And that's how it stayed for years. Until one night, we became something more. We had a few months, we had that. There was a weekend in Udaipur. We sat by a lake and watched the sun go down. I remember thinking, I will never be this happy. And I was right. Because quite suddenly it was over. We'd fallen asleep and they'd found us. For me, it was bad enough. But I already knew who I was. And I think my family kind of guessed. For Manoj, the disgrace was absolute. A double taboo. His father was fired, they were sent away. All of them. I don't know what I could have done. But it should have been more than nothing. I put up no fight. I let it happen. Soon afterwards, I went to England, to university. I had always told myself that I'd come back. But I never did. Until now. And now I think, what if I am the last person on earth that he wants to see? I just don't think I can go through with it. How do you get your ex back? You don't. After you go through a breakup, look, this is one of the most painful things that we endure, and we always will second guess it, even if we're the one that initiated it, because we're gonna start to remember the emotional good times and think that maybe we could get back to that. We're gonna play all these mental gymnastics to try and convince ourselves it's right. From my experience, you know, the two long-term relationships, breakups that I went through, those are like some of the best periods that built, not the best, but some of the most important periods that like built me up as a man. Because when you're going through that pain, when you dig deep, you commit yourself to the gym, you recommit yourself to your goals, that can act like kind of like a rubber band moment where yeah, you feel like you're down deep, you're down deep, but then you come back stronger than ever. So you need to do it not just for the relationship because you deserve a relationship that better fits your needs. If the relationship was that good, it wouldn't have ended in the first place. But also this is the world challenging you to get to that next level. Keep your head down, grind, don't go back.